2015 was the International Year of Soils, and we recently had a chance to talk to a research scientist at the Great Lakes Forestry Centre during their 70-year anniversary open house. I'm a research scientist and I study forest soil ecology. Uh, so I'm interested in looking at uh, the physical, chemical and biological properties of soils and understanding all of that goes on within soils and, and understanding how processes scale from a very small scale all the way up to the landscape. Soils uh, have obviously been around for forever and um, but the way that we study soils has actually changed quite a bit in the last uh, probably two decades. We've moved from only going out and measuring soil properties out in the field. Uh, we have more in-depth um, chemical analysis that we do in the labs. And we also have new technologies like remote sensing and LIDAR digital elevation models that have taken our understanding of soils uh, up to a new level. Soils are very important to our planet's biodiversity. Among many benefits, soils provide important nutrients to plants as well as contribute to our human health. Soils do for so much for us in our everyday life. Um, there's many sort of ecosystem services that they provide for us. Uh, for example, they provide uh, our source of nutrients uh, for plants and trees in order to grow. Uh, they store carbon, which is good because that keeps carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere. And they're also important in terms of being a, a reservoir of water so that it uh, provides us with a clean and, and uh, secure source of water. So the one thing that people might not realize is when they look at soils, uh, they see the mineral part of it, they see, you know, they see the rock, the stone, the sand, but uh, people often forget that there's actually a lot of life in those soils. Um, you may see earthworms or you may see small rodents, um, but actually most of the biodiversity is contained within the, the soil microorganisms, the fungi and the bacteria that are, that are within there. And they perform a really important role in terms of the decomposition of organic matter like leaves that falls onto the soil. And they are the way in which nutrients are recycled so that the plants can use them. Um, the other interesting thing about these microorganisms is actually they produce um, chemicals that are antibiotic substances. And in fact, most of the inf infections that uh, antibiotics we use to fight infections come from soil microorganisms. So soils are very important for all sorts of different reasons. To find out more information about soil, one of nature's most complex ecosystems, you can visit nrcan.gc.ca. For Go On Shaw TV, I'm Greg Seiler.